What's up YouTube for tonight? We have a full Pokemon egg team. Now, uh, these are the eggs I got from Pokemon Go. I hatched six consecutively in uh, the same space of time. I was actually going down a really, really long jetty at, at this point. So was, I just turned my recorder on and hatched all six eggs. And we're going to do a little cup battle with these Pokemon. Um, it was pretty fun too. Uh, if you haven't seen any more of my Pokemon Go stuff, make sure you check that out. That's a couple of videos. Uh, behind this one and yeah, make sure you leave your theme team suggestions in the comment section below. Go for it Okay, this was a pretty fun little cup battle to say the least right So we have a Larvitar lead here and I have a Mankey lead So I thought okay, this is pretty decent now. I was actually running uh, a little bit of a different Mankey set um, I had brick break on this one to uh, get rid of some screens and stuff So that's what I went with on this set. And I had gunk shot on this for some fairies. I had ice punch uh, as well and I actually had a Focus Sash and Acrobatics. Okay, so I can't really do much to coughing at all because it's about very defensively bulky. So I'm going to bring in my Meowth here, which is a special attacking set. I thought it may go for will o -Wisp there, so that's why I swapped in my Meowth um, there. So I've got Echoed Voice on this. I've got Metronome to boost the power of that too. Um, if you don't know, the move Echo Verse gets a boost every time you use it and caps out at 200 base power. Okay, and also it's stab on uh, Meowth as well, so it's hitting pretty hard. Okay, so I've got my nasty plot up here. Now Lickitung comes in. Now, I'm not going to be liking a body slam or anything, any any sort of move, because Lickitung is very, very strong, and it's very, very bulky at the same time. Okay, so going for my first Echoed Voice there, that does pretty good damage there, considering it's Lickitung. Uh, it's definitely max special defense. Uh, it goes for Power Up Punch there, and it's going to boost its attack. Okay, so I don't have much to swap into and I may as well go for the next echoed voice to see if I can get some like higher base damage on it since it's going to be consecutive so go for the second one that does loads of damage there one more would have taken it out but uh, Lickitung's going to be able to take me out with a power up punch there but that's all good uh, it's in killing range which is the main thing okay it's got plus two attack too so I need to watch out um, I might, it might be a sweeping set I'm a bulky sweeping set I'm not too sure okay so I'm gonna bring a Machop in here and try and scare it out this is actually a special defensive Machop okay so here I went for the knockoff because I did predict the uh, coughing coming back in here and I'm gonna get rid of that Everlight which is good now um, I was thinking well it probably won't have Will-O-Wisp and Toxic but it's actually a rest sleeping talk uh, sleeping talk i did that in the other video seriously i need to actually go to sleep because it's quite late okay so i swapped in bell sprout at the off chance i go for toxic again i didn't think it would because um you know it can have uh, guts and that sort of ability too okay so i went for ring out there just for a little bit of damage there i wanted to get hit by something so i've got my uh, orange berry here to activate um which is nice there now orange Bar berry is uh, very nice to uh, use in little cup too uh berry juice is more superior but i needed to activate a berry for a special move that I had on it which is gunk shot otherwise i would have used uh, berry juice now um so i've got gunk shot i've got ring out now ring out is powered um, by the more health the Pokemon has, the more damage it's going to do. So it's a very risky move. Okay, so uh, I went for Gunk Shot there. I thought I was actually going to get outsped here, so I just stayed in. I thought I'd be fodder, and it goes for U-Turn there and doesn't even take me out. So I was expecting a, a definitely a flying base move there, but they probably predicted me to swap there. Okay, so anyway, Lickitung is going to come back in here. Um, I was like, well, bugger, I might as well just go for the Belch again. I said Gunk Shot, I meant Belch. Sorry about that, guys. Um, I'm going to go for the Belch here. Uh, now, to use the move Belch, you actually have to eat a berry or consume a berry. Um, that's why I, I ran that over very useful. Okay, so uh, Mime Jr. comes in here. I was like, well, might as well go for the Belch again because it's super effective. And it just hangs on by like a tiny little bit of health here. Um, it's going to finish me off with the Psychic there. Um, but Belch Sprout did amazing there. That was really cool using that Belch set. Okay, so it's only got a little bit of health left. I can bring any of my Pokemon in here to finish it off. I was like, well, I might as well just bring in my Nidoran and use uh, Sucker Punch uh, to finish it off there. Okay, so Sucker Punch fails and it goes for the Thunder Wave. So I'm like, ah, it's got Thunder Wave. Right, so I was like, well, they may try and set up something here, like maybe a nasty pot. So I might go for Poison Jab here and it's going to attack me straight away. So uh, yeah, good play there with the, with the Mime Jr. That was uh, nice. Um, my Nidoran didn't get too much there, but it was a Hustle Nidoran set, Home Claws, Sucker Punch, Poison Jab, Drill Run from Tudor uh, on that one for Electric Types. Okay, so I'm going to bring my Mega here, which I probably should have just done at the start, and I'm uh, going to finish it off there with the Ice Punch. Um, I, I, wanted to, I wanted to sort of save my Mankey for a bit later. Anyways, um, so we've got Laughter here. I was like, that's a strange swap into Mankey. Um, I had, do have another Pokemon which would have come in like a lot better than that one. It just lives on a tiny little bit of health there. I thought I may have Focus Sash, so I went for the Ice Punch there to try and get a freeze. But it turned out it didn't have Focus Sash. It actually had Toxic Orb with Guts. So, 
yeah, it's going to get that Dragon Ants up and it's going to use Facade and that's going to take me all the way down to my Focus Sash. <laughs> so I had Focus Sash on this one. It's quite funny because I thought they may have Focus Sash swapping into that one. I thought oh, it could be Scarf or something really weird like that. Anyway, so I'm going to finish Lavatar off with the Ice Punch there and uh, down that goes. So that was good. Now, there's uh, two Pokemon left. The main one I was worried about was that Archer. Okay, so Cubone's going to come in here. The best thing I can do here is go for the Ice Punch again. It's super effective. Does pretty good damage. Cubone's got nice base defense, so it takes out you know, pretty well considering. And it's going to go for the Earthquake there, definitely taking out my uh, Ma uh, Machop, my Mankey. Okay, so all I've got left is my Machop and my Slowpoke. So I thought Slowpoke would be a nice swap in here. I can go for the Scold and just take it out. Now, Cubone has uh, got extremely high attack, so that hits my Slowpoke very hard. I'm a defensively based Slowpoke there, so it really does take a nice chunk of damage off me. And uh, But Scold is going to be able to easily one-shot Cubone there. Okay, so the last Pokemon is the Archer. Now, I was a bit worried because... I didn't have too much health left, and I had the regenerate ability, so I thought, well, let's swap out here, get my regenerate health back, and swap in Machop. Now, uh, Machop was that special defensive set, so I knew it wouldn't take it that well. It goes for Pluck. I'm like, damn, I haven't seen that one for a while. Um, that nearly takes me out in one shot there. It's going to outspeed me. I, I've got Power Up Punch and Knock Off, Rest, Sleep, Talk. Um, special defensive and bulky in health. So that goes down, and my last Pokemon is the Slowpoke. I was like, well, I should just have enough uh, defense and health back to uh, live the next attack. I'm going for Scald here. And then it goes for Head Smash. I'm like, damn, this is going to hit really hard. And it does. It almost takes me out there. Um, it pop, it actually pops its Orin Berry there too to get rid of Defeatus, which is a nice little strategy. And uh, I'm going to go for Scald. And that's going to be easily enough to take out the Archon. And that is game. Hope you guys enjoy this one. It was a, it was a really quick but uh, fun battle. Um, I've got some more theme teams coming up and some more Pokemon Go. Okay, peace out. Thank you.